Well, Colorado led the way when it came to legalizing recreational marijuana. Now dramatic changes could be coming to the way people are charged for drug possession. Many felonies would become misdemeanors. Our Jeff Todd live in Denver on the top story tonight. Jeff, many in law enforcement say this bill at the Capitol is a bad idea. Jim, but advocates for change say that the evidence is overwhelming. The threat of a felony is not changing drug habits, but the consequences stick around for a long time after an addict cleans up. I started using it at age five, and I, I didn't stop using until uh, a year after my arrest. Hassan Latif knows what people just coming out of prison are going through. Myself, I, I, I'm, I'm a convicted felon been home 13 years now after serving 18 years in prison in Colorado. I'll forever have that tag on me. Being a convicted felon made it hard to get jobs out of prison, so he started working on recovery. He wrote a book about staying out of prison and also became a certified addiction counselor. He started the Second Chance Center in Aurora. We work with men and women coming home from incarceration, and this bill in particular is one that we think uh, will go a long way to lowering felony filings. I Representative Leslie Herod is leading the charge to get possession of small quantities of certain drugs dropped from a felony to a misdemeanor. The idea is to treat people for addiction instead of putting them in a prison cell. Don't Sheriffs from around Colorado oppose the measure, fearing that the drugs will bring more violence. But advocates say it's a needed change. This is the only disease, addiction, that is still treated punitively. I think if you incarcerate someone who has a drug problem, that that solves the problem. It really does not solve the problem. In fact, most often it aggravates it. There was a lot of concern today that this bill does not do anything to add more treatment, especially in rural parts of Colorado. That may come in later bills, but this will continue to work its way through the legislature, likely the first step in changing how the state treats drug offenses. We're live in Denver tonight. Jeff Todd covering Colorado first.